Hi guys, welcome back. Today Claudia is doing my makeup. Yeah, I decided to do her makeup again. Uh, I did this kind of green and gold makeup look today and I thought I'm just gonna recreate it on her. Make me look good, please. All right. <laughs> so she's got her brows done already because I didn't feel like doing them. But yeah, we're gonna start with the foundation, I suppose. Because I already primed my face. All right. So we're gonna use the NARS uh, Radiant Longwear Foundation. This is in the color Sahel, Sahel, Sahil, Sahel, Sahil. Please don't put it on my top. Okay, I'll, I'll try. Use use this brush maybe. Okay, I'm gonna pretend like I'm a pro makeup artist and I'm gonna put it on my hand. You know what I mean? Ew, that's not very pro. You need a special plate. Oh, <laughs> all right, then I'm not a pro. <laughs> brushes from like last year from Iconic London and look how cute they are I never use them because they're just too pretty but I thought you know what mm. today's the day I think you shouldn't talk oh <laughs> <laughs> why I mean I don't know maybe you can but can you be a bit gentle no I actually hate when people do my makeup oh you wanted me to do your makeup come on because I didn't want to do yours <laughs> what I'm also so pale on my face because I just put fake on yesterday. I look like a ghost. Anyway, I'm gonna try my best to make her look decent. You know, she's obviously not gonna look as good as me. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, yeah, just like I'll be, I'll be moving her face towards me. Yeah, put a lot of foundation. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Dark. That's my beauty spot. What? He's trying to scratch my beauty spot? <laughs> <laughs> Dear God. Put foundation back on it. It's alright. Do this. This? Yeah. So I go like there. So you've got head on your face. <laughs> alright. <laughs> well, this is going well. Yeah, you only just applied foundation. Well, I kind of want to do a proper job. Because we're actually going out today. Yeah, in two hours. And... We don't have much time. I don't know, but we are so bad at our time. We're always late, we're always la rushing, we're always stressing. Yes. Oh my gosh, look at the moon! It's a full moon! And it looks like there's clouds on it or something, I don't know. Mm. The key is to blend. You know, trying to be pro. <laughs> Ow. You know whenever I like press on my nose, I can't breathe. Like that, yeah. Why? I don't know, just like the nose type. Anyway, why am I holding this beauty blender? I was gonna do it with the beauty blender and then I didn't. Um, all right, let's do some contour. bronzer. Mm, bronzer. Let's do some contour. I'm gonna use this Huda Beauty contour in uh, light. Ooh, I'm gonna snatch you up. Just don't put too much. All right, all right. Just gonna put a little and then blend it all together. You know. Do you want me to put it on your nose? To make it smaller? Alright. Just a tiny bit. I have fat nose. Yeah. From close up it doesn't look that fat. Really? Yeah. Just a bit. I mean, my nose actually doesn't look as that bad in real life. It just looks bad on pictures and like photography. Let's see. I didn't do that straight, but it's alright. Yeah, it's fine, you'll blend that out. Yeah, I'll blend that up. <laughs> bit here, bit here. To get rid of that fat. I don't have fat there. Really? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's blend it. 
Being a model is so difficult. <laughs> You're not a model. I have pain in my back. <laughs> you should be privileged that I'm doing your makeup and you don't have At to. At least do I don't have to do anything. I can be on my phone. You can't. Why? Because this is a professional work. <laughs> Wait, whose dog was this? Oh. Anyway, this way. Sometimes I feel like if you blend too much, the foundation like disappears. Yeah, especially when you're doing contour, disappears. But anyway, get that double chin. I don't have double chin. Oh well. I think everyone do. All right, concealer time. We're gonna use the good old, old tart in light medium. Why are you looking at me? <laughs> no, where am I supposed to look? I don't know, not at me! <laughs> Alright. Don't move, man. Am I supposed to make your nose straight or no? I fucked up. <laughs> anyway, it's alright. It's alright. We're using a nice little beauty blender ow just don't like do anything <laughs> i'm not doing anything well so don't even like ow me you have to be quiet you need to be gentle you can't really be gentle like we're not really gentle people <laughs> <laughs> you know what i mean oh. we're a bit rough <laughs> I'm not rough, you are. Really? I mean, I don't know. I feel like when you're gentle, you're slow. And I'm not slow. <laughs> uh, Alright. That looks pretty nice. Yeah? Yeah. Let's see. Would you consider yourself a makeup artist? No! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I just like makeup. That's about it. I like makeup on myself. And other people. Yeah. That's it? Alright, let's set this up with the <sighs> Laura Mercier. Okay, now look up and don't move. Faster! I'm trying to get the excess powder off. So I first set it up. Get the wet out. Yeah. Just tap it on her. This this side. Oh, crease a little bit. This beauty blender smells like Christmas. What? Smell it. Well, being a makeup artist is a difficult job. It's hard. I'm sorry. It's hard because you don't know if you you gonna you know do a good job on that person if they're gonna like it. Well, you better. <laughs> like you have to be so confident in yourself. Mm. Every time I do someone makeup, someone's makeup, but even like for fun, I'm scared. Should I bake you up? I don't know. I don't really bake. Do you bake? Uh, uh, I've been baking recently. Oh. Okay. Or should I not? That's why your your under eye looks like it's cracking. Well, because I put powder three times. So alright, I'm not gonna bake you. We're gonna set it with the Kat Von D. This is actually a powder foundation. Powder foundation, yeah. I like it because it gives me full coverage. Yeah, it gives a nice kind of um, full coverage, especially if you're going out in the evening. I'm gonna bake bake you up though. Huh? I thought you're not gonna bake. But just here. Just a little bit. Let's see. Yeah, I'll do. Okay, I'm gonna clean the brows with the Huda Beauty Concealer. This is the best one for that I'm 
also gonna prime the lid with the same concealer so the eyeshadow applies nicer okay i'm gonna use this beautiful norvina palette and this palette has the perfect absolutely stunning look at that i'm gonna use this green here and this gold here so the green is called c5 and the gold d2 okay so first i'm gonna use color b2 that's like a transition color it's like a light brown we always need a transition color when you're doing a makeup look all right that's that now i'm gonna do the green part so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go in a outer corner and then inner corner and then we're gonna leave the middle for the gold Ooh, yeah and then just keep blending and keep applying the product this is a really pretty green like it's it's really shiny and then go in the inner corner like so you don't have a puff you're not a professional what the puff fuck the puff <clears throat> all right let's do this side can i talk yeah you can <laughs> hmm can you talk? No. Oh. I'm concentrated on this job. I can't really talk. Trying to do a good job in here, you know? <laughs> By the way, I'm sitting on about 10 cushions. <laughs> She's about to fall down and break her neck. <laughs> I'm literally like sitting on 10 cushions and I'm like falling. Because we couldn't find a high chair. Yeah. It's actually a very easy makeup look, I think. Yeah, you just put literally two colors. Two colors and just blend and blend and blend. Okay, we're gonna use the gold now. And I'm actually gonna use Fix Plus with it. So it's even more strong. And you just apply it in the middle. Mm -hmm. I really like this gold. So this makeup is inspired by Nikki Makeup. She is really such a great makeup artist. Yeah, I love and her. And I just love her makeup looks. So this is actually her recreation. I'm gonna put some brow kind of highlight. Oh yeah. I'm putting the, our favorite, the Tarte. Paint pot, actually. The wind is so crazy today. Yeah, that's why you probably can hear it again. Oopsie! Oh, actually, what I'm also gonna do is I'm gonna use the same gold and put it in the inner, inner corner. This is what I did, and it looks really, really nice. Let's do the bottom color and for the bottom we're also going to put the green, the green here and in the inner corner and we'll leave the space in the middle for the gold. So it's exactly the same as the top lid. Are you happy? <laughs> no. So why are you smiling at? I don't know, or am I supposed to cry? <laughs> wow, the moon looks absolutely amazing. Oh wow. It's like surrounded by clouds. It looks uh, like from a horror movie. It looks like from a... Wow. Oh wow, look, they're moving! Oh, Do wow. a video! It's a bit, you're a bit too far, you know? <laughs> Like zoom in. Alright, 
Oh, it's gone. It's gone, man. Okay. Right, and now I'm gonna apply the gold in the middle. Just there. See? So it gives it like a nice type of pop. Pop of color, you know? Is that it? I'm gonna use this brown eye pencil on the waterline. Please, oh, Claudia, what? Just, you, you're too fast. Just be slow. Like this? Yeah. There? Yeah. All right. I don't want to like, have a sense of irritation. Right, we need mascara on the lower lash. You're gonna do this? Uh, can you do it for yourself? <laughs> Okay, the mascara on the lower lash line is done and now we're gonna actually finish the eye with one last thing and this is gonna make the eyes pop so much. We're gonna use this gold kind of glitter pot and this is from Lottie London and this was the Twilly collaboration that she did. This is called Diamond Dips. Mm. Face and body glitter gel. So it's like a glitter gel but it's amazing, like, look at that. It's super gold. I don't know if you can see it, but it's so gold. It's like a glitter type. So I'm just gonna apply it with my finger, just on the gold part, just like so. Close. Yeah. Oh, it's really nice. Okay, the eyes are done. Let me just get rid of this bakage that we did. Okay, we're gonna contour now and we're gonna use this Natasha Denona contouring and sculpting powder. Contour and sculpting powder. Um, I'm just gonna contour a little bit, not too much, because this is quite dark. Oh, it's actually very dark. <laughs> Oops, free. All right. Can I see, see a bit here? But yeah, I'm gonna contour this, then we're gonna add some bronzer. I think that's bronzer. Well, it's kind of like a contour type of bronzer, but it's very dark, so it's good for contour. And then for the bronzer, we're gonna use this Kiko bronzer. This is actually one of my favorite bronzers at the moment. It's from the Ocean Feel collection. I love the smell. And we're gonna bronze up the face you're looking a bit pale and you know you need to put a lot of bronzer <laughs> don't forget the neck the double chin we're gonna use the Anastasia blush trio and peach love. peachy love peachy love just these two colors together Because peachy looks quite nice with green. Okay, and then for the highlight, we're gonna use this really pretty highlight from this is from Marc Jacobs, and this is called Seventy Nine Gil Guilty. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, this is the highlight we're gonna use. It's like a really nice type of gold highlight. This is super gold. Oh, I think I put too much. <laughs> it's super gold highlight. As you can see, a bit of here, a bit of on the chin, but not too much because this is a quite a dark highlight. See? Yeah. All right. Let's finish the makeup, and we're gonna do the lips now. Let's use this. This is a lip pencil from Colourpop. This is the Isle of Sarah E collection. It's in the color. What is this color? Curve? Curve? Is that the color? Curve. Curve 2 or something. I don't no, know. no, no. But it's like a brown kind of a color. Do you trust me with your lips? 
No, right. I should overline them super big. <laughs> Don't you open li your lips at me. <laughs> You're like <laughs> breathing the air in my face. What, am I not supposed to breathe? No, not when you do your lips, you don't. And then what we're gonna use is we're gonna use our, one of our favorite nude lipstick and this is Penelope Pink from Charlotte Tilbury. This is like a super nude, light nude. And then to finish the lips, we're gonna use some gloss and this is So Juicy by Colourpop. Plumping gloss. Ooh, I love these. These are really nice. They actually make your lips like super big and kind of extra glossy. This is kind of a goldy, golden type of color. So they're really thick and I really like them. I like this when I go out because when you put that, it's just gonna stay for a long time. Yeah, because it's really like thick, thick, but yeah. not sticky. Yeah, it's not sticky, but it doesn't go anywhere as well. Okay, let's put some brow gel on on these brows. We're just gonna brush them a little bit up so they look a bit more fluffy. And let's put some Fix Plus to oh. finish you off. I'm scared. Just chill, yeah. Laura! <laughs> <laughs> no! You're gonna fall from there. <laughs> you, you didn't spray this side. Well, because you... Laura, what are you doing? You're so aggressive with this spray. How can you be aggressive with this spray? It's not me. <gasps> All right, I guess this is the finished look. Is it? Are you ready to see yourself? Yeah. All right. Let me do that mirror. Mm -hmm. Not bad. You like it? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's pretty much how I look, so yeah, she already right. probably knew how she's gonna look anyway, but... We hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.